Okay. Production, so you. Oh! Well, that's cool. I can, uh. I didn't know I can do that. Make a whole bunch of these. I'm gonna need a whole bunch, anyways. You actually snap pretty nicely there, too. Like, I don't have to really fight you. Good, okay. And you, my friend. Wait, can I put in another one? Put another one just yet. Okay, so you let's configure you. You're gonna be iron plates. And I would like to do a storage thing right away. For that I need plates. Some plates. Oh, I also need rods. Next one's going to be rods. Go. Okay, so storage. There we go. Let's build another one. Oh, I didn't line them up. Uh, okay. That good. No. Must line up. Here, let's do it this way. Or do you not? Okay. There. There we go. Okay. You, my friend, are going to be straight up rods. Can I go through? I can go through! So I would like to... Let's see, I want to shut everything off here. So let's just take this down. Take that down. Things gonna be shutting off real soon. So let us let's put a power pole right there. And it's gonna come from you to this, you to this, and you 
v1 save out can I no okay, let's put you here put another one right about there you are going to connect to that and you are going to connect to that and you are going to connect to another one oh, over there, but not just yet. So that's our smelter, and I am going to get rid of this. Can I build some more? Build two more, so I need more rods. Wait, do I want to build two more? Mm. Yes, yes, I want to build two more. Okay, so let us take away you. Good. I'll take away you two and same with you. And you. Okay. So let's see the splitter. You split it three ways. Okay, that's cool. So let's put you about there. And then we'll get a splitter. Oh, it's best to place you first. Gotcha. There. The conveyor. Right into there. Okay, so you're going into there. Now I want two smelters. Let's see, I want one smelter feeding into this. I'm gonna have the other smelter feeding into that. I think that'll be fine. I have you, let's say, here. I'll have another one here. You guys aren't powered, I know about that. I could have you guys reconnect again. Mm. I do it that way. And that stopped, I know that stopped. So right now I'm thinking, so do I have a conveyor coming from here over to that one and one to this one? Or do I have them kind of combined into one and then split up again? No, that's, that's probably too messy. Okay, so let's try this. So if I do this and here... And then this here, encroaching on another clearance, okay. Oh, what if 
I I'm going to get in there to there. Yeah, I'm not completely happy with it, but it'll work. thing right about here you can connect to this one here you can connect to this one here Wait, now I have to configure you to that bring you to that What? They probably would mix in together. Okay, I want to do that. I want it nice and clean. That's what I want. Oh, I want a merge. Should have had it facing this way. I was thinking I could have. Oh, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Okay. this Let's make sure everything is lined up there we go there we go you can come in I want to put now a splitter hmm it might be best if we Put a platform there. Oh, but there's these. You know what? You're going. Oh, oh, good. I thought I got rid of the wrong thing. I probably can I. Let's do the do list. Okay. Sure, right there. This is probably not the best thing ever, but yeah. Set what this was. Oh no, I got rid of the power. Uh, 
Let's put that right here. Let's grab another one. So we'll put you about, about here. And then I can set you back up to connect to that one. Okay. percent that's good and you also say you're 100 percent okay I wonder if you can get like a faster conveyor and all that because now that I'm thinking about it even adding in another one here, which is what I was thinking of doing, wouldn't really work that well. At least this part here works. And you guys seem to be producing well, good. And then we have that 25, 22, good. Right now, you're just producing these. That's all that you really need to produce for now. Now, this next one I would like would be rods. I, I would need two of these. Because to make the screws, we need iron rods. Now, the other option is I could split this I put a splitter here and half of these rods are used for storage while the other half is used for screws it's an option hmm But it's working so far. And I know I can I can actually have them all going in the same thing. Paleodictia bread berries or pale berries can be added to the object scanner catalog after unlocking the new blueprint in hub tier one. Okay, um, I want this one next. This one should be fairly easy for us. Right now it's just a waiting game actually with this one. Yeah, we'll need to make some some of these cables and all. Okay. Hmm. I wonder if co is copper used for anything else? you doing and how are you doing oh you're nearly out uh oh There we go. Um, oops. The whole spaceship thing. 400, 500, 
Might need storage soon for that. Can these be... No, I was hoping they can be configured or something. Oh, power! Could be that it's too much for our, um... Current setup. There's another iron rod or two. So if I place you I don't know. This To power line to this one. Oh, it also turns on those. Oh, maybe that was a problem. I didn't I didn't see that in here. Alien organs. This No. Well that's there. Um so right now I'm debating do I build the big space thing? How big is it actually? Fairly big. Fairly big. Well, actually has inputs and all that. Oh. Okay, so that thing probably takes takes a lot of stuff. Uh, let's see how much copper we have over here. Okay, we can do the 500. Just want to see how everything's going up here. I mean, it's moving. Probably split it and have two making copper. I mean, uh, the wires. We. We could do that. Let me take all. Let me destroy that. Hmm. No, we could do that. I mean, you make. What, what is it required to make these wires? Make. Oh, okay, it's one, one copper ingot for three wires. Place you in, place you, place you. You grab you. You grab you. I gotta figure out this power situation. I don't know if the plants grow back or not. Grab. Kind of why I want the 
uh, whole uh, shuttle thing. This thing's actually fairly slow. I'll even get a, get away with a second one. You. And just think, this is all ran off of plants. Get some more biofuel. That one up fully. Let's get you up fully. And you up fully. Okay, let's do. I want to make screws and all that. So. I think we'll do it where it's its own assembly line. Okay. So I need more screws, it looks like. You. You. Actually, probably make enough. Nah, that, that's fine. I was just saying I could probably make enough to um, uh, send up our our thing up. Instructor. You go in there. Okay, and we're going to have another one right behind. Right there. So you are going to be iron rods. You are going to be screws. And then I can have a new storage. Right there. Okay, so let's say let's add you to can I put this in here? I can. 
Okay, you power that one. You power that one. Okay, now I'll need a new... I mean, I... You stop. You do stop. You know what, for now, let's just do that. I mean, I don't need as many screws, like, because you make so many screws just from one uh, iron rod and all that. I wonder where the plastic bins come from. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah, and plus, th these are being held back anyway, so... Let's see, you are... 1% efficient. Really? I am so not efficient, I guess. 1%. Okay. Well, at least it's being produced automatically. Let's grab you. Let's grab you. And let's get you guys going. Oh, so close. I don't want to make it manually. So I had these machines. Forty-five per minute. I should I should make a storage for that too. Okay, so this thing is going to need the next thing is going to need plates. And screws. Kind of sucks because this is in the middle here. What are you doing? Pretty good. And you? 16. Uh, we need 21. Yeah, okay, that's enough for you. Need one more. I'm interested in that uh, assembler there. Big red button! Push! Milestone reached. More complex assembly of parts can now be automated. 